So then I told her, if you're not willing to do your job the right way, you better start looking for a new one. Oh, Brenda, you are too wild. Don't you think so, Maddie? Oh, yeah, Tracy. Brenda's a real loose cannon. Oh, what's wrong, Maddie? You still upset about your budget presentation to the PTA? Don't worry, no one hardly noticed you stammering around up there. Miranda! No, it's okay, Susan. And no, it's not that. I'm really glad you ladies let me join your vegan recipe club, but I have a confession. I am a matador. <laughs> <laughs> we know, Maddie. You do? How come you never said anything? It doesn't bother us any. But I fight bulls for sport. And I still eat meat on Fridays. <gasps> Tracy! <laughs> what? It's just veal. It don't hardly count. <laughs> well, how could you tell? What made it so obvious? I was the first one to suspect there was more to you than meets the eye. It started when I saw you hanging up your laundry one day in your first week here. Hmm, something unusual about it. I couldn't help but notice that all of your laundry was red towels. <laughs> Just dozens and dozens of red towels. And as I watched you flap those towels around in the wind, I thought something about that just seemed strange. And I started to suspect something shortly after that. Y'all know my little corgi, Dart. Well, it was just about that time. Dart likes to jump on everyone. Everyone comes over to my house. Everyone, except you, that is. Huh. That first time you came over, Dart didn't jump on you any. And I thought to myself, something about that just seemed strange. <laughs> huh. And I started to notice something shortly after that. Ever since you moved here, there's been this strange car that just keeps driving down our street. Now, there's nothing strange about the car, per se. It's just how slowly it's been cruising down our street. I am talking foot off the gas, just a creeping. But what's more interesting is that the driver of that car always seems to be a bull. <laughs> and so I thought to myself, I thought, now, why would a bull be so interested in all our neighborhood? <laughs> and as I thought that, I just thought something about that seems a bit strange. Huh. Well, I didn't know I was making it so obvious. Oh, you did your best, but you still made mistakes. Just like in your budget presentation to the PTA. <laughs> Volunteer my time at the local school. 
I'm the treasurer for the Redview Elementary PTA. Not a very good treasurer. I know. <laughs> Look, I can see that you and your friends are very busy, so let's stop wasting time. Who are you, and what is it that you do? Enough! I will not sit by as you badger her. Yeah, quit hindering her. And the horse you came in on. Her name is Amanda. And despite not knowing what a decimal point is, she is the best damn treasurer the Redview Elementary PTA has ever seen. This does not concern you. And as I was saying, you over here look at me. Ha <laughs> ha! 